实俄乌战争像我前面所说的，在美国总统大选之前，它需要一个和平协议最后落幕。但是欧洲可能被永久的改变，因为欧洲很快的即将迎来好几场的选举，而欧洲现在各个国家都忍受了通货膨胀，这个通货膨胀导致了右派的崛起，也导致了左派的罢工潮。按照统计，过去这段时间里头。整个欧洲人民实值，他们的人民收入是下降了百分之六点五，但是他的粮食价格大涨了百分之十九点五，年轻的失业率也相当的高，这将成为整个欧洲政治一个光谱，永久的改变。尽管这个战争现在看起来很强，而且即将进入尾声，但是欧洲的政治势力将被永久的改变。都说冬天来了，春天还会远吗？但是在一个被俄乌战打乱的世界 ，France is living through another period of street protests and widespread strikes. Planes, trains, and buses came to a standstill as Germany endured its largest day in decades of industrial action in March. Hundreds of thousands of public sector workers have been taking part in strikes in recent weeks, with many more industrial actions planned. It's one of the strongest strike waves in the United Kingdom in decades. Persistent double-digit inflation and the back-breaking cost of living crisis continue to take a toll on the lives of the millions in the UK. This is from the summer of despair to the summer of summer. The protests in the UK and the street activities into 2023 are more and more intense, and it has spread to other countries in the UK. The protests are an important part of the UK's life and life culture. The United States and the United States have been in the UK for the past few years. The protests are the most important part of the UK's life and life culture. It started with energy, but a cost of living crisis has now spread to all sectors and all countries across Europe. The problem has many components, but the one that really concerns political leaders and affects households the most is food price inflation. In February, gas prices in Europe fell to their lowest level in almost 18 months. However, food prices are continuing their upward trend. In January, food prices across the European Union rose by an average of 18.4 percent compared to a year ago. Hungary suffered the most at 48.2%, followed by Lithuania at 32. The lowest were Sweden at 5.8% and Cyprus at 10.3. 英国和法国2022年的通胀率皆达到了40年以来的最高水平。根据世界经济论坛2023年全球风险报告，生活成本危机是最严重的短期全球风险。生活成本的急剧上涨，甚至会导致一些地方出现人道主义危机。Higher food and energy prices have contributed to rampant inflation and continue to dent living standards in Europe as elsewhere, most especially for the lowest paid, according to Gregory Clays from the Brussels-based economic think tank Bruegel. If you're poor, generally the inflation that you face, the level of inflation that you face, is actually higher because you spend more of your、uh, your money on、uh, on things that have、uh, increased a lot, like energy,、um, food, etc. 通膨怪兽吃掉民众薪资，偏偏又遇上解封后缺工、俄乌战争扰乱供应链等因素，员工们无可奈何，只能罢工，要求政府加薪。例如，德国两大运输工会 B E R D I 要求加薪百分之十点五 ，E V G 希望加薪百分之十二。They say that there's a cost of living、uh, problem here in Germany. We have seen inflation consistently above 8% since September, so costs are rising. And union bosses are saying that this is a matter of survival for their workers, so they really want more money. Governments still seem to be trapped in the ideology、um, that they can't raise taxes significantly, and therefore they've、uh, imposed on themselves. 
an artificial uh, restriction on their ability to uh, to pay uh, higher wages. France is a rich country and as a result of the productivity gains over the last 10 years is easily able to maintain its pension arrangements at their current level uh, without having to, to do what President Macron is attempting to do. And that's that, that, that doubles the, uh, the anger among working people. And that could mean more strikes in Germany and protests and walkouts in France.